Hello again, everyone. Um, a video on a different topic, different subject. Um, I got recently bought a Penn Central box car at a model train show. Um, I, I, just, I think it would, I thought it would make a nice model to my in addition to my layout. Okay, for some freight operations. Anyway, um, it was three rail. So with a steel floor, with three rail trucks, which are gone. And what I did was I went ahead and took that steel floor and made a pattern for um, and made a pattern for a styrene floor, and also switched out the trucks for um, Atlas trucks that I took out the plastic wheels and replaced them with intermountain wheels. Okay, um, in the trucks and they do flex pretty nicely. To go over, you know, bumps and stuff, you know, and um, so, and I also have KD couplers I have to install in them, you know, um. Not my usual forte. I'm mean, not my usual. That's not. I'm mean, usually forte. I've done this before, but mostly with subway cars. But I don't get to do it to a box car too often. Anyway, it still has an intact brake wheel. Yay! <laughs> um, if I had the not the wherewithal, but if I had the patience to do so and stuff, I really don't want to do it. But uh, if I wanted to, I take the ladders off and make brass ladders. Um, but I could get a make up a decal for the reporting mark placard over here. You know. So this is just a nice little project. I have to put, the reason I haven't done this yet, finished the floor yet, is because I have to put the beam work, the center beams, and the the trucks bolsters, you know, the bolsters for the trucks to be mounted on here and here. And um, also the side beams that go along from that stretch out from the center sill, you know, and then I get to mount this and um, then it's done. So yeah, I also want to adjust the car body height, <clears throat> you know, as far as that goes, you know, and, um, yeah, so you can see how closely it fits inside, you know, like I usually do, I keep my floor, my floors have almost zero gap, you know, seriously, when I make a floor, but it's a subway car or a freight car, it has almost zero gap in it, so, anyway, I'm going to put these back in here for now, because they're going in, they're going to be... This is me getting done over the next week or so. And some other stuff. So, hope you guys enjoyed this. If you have any questions, critiques, or comments, feel free to message me, email me, whatever. Okay? So, you guys have a great weekend. By the way, it is Sunday, June 9th. Yes, I'm making another video. Just catching up on you guys on projects and what I've been up to. All right? I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.